Day five, Proverbs chapter five. Proverbs chapter five, again, is addressed to the son. My son, give attention to my wisdom. Chapter five teaches us to avoid sexual immorality, the adulteress, really any sexual immorality, lust, pornography, whatever it is, verses three through eight. Avoid sexual immorality, lest you lose wealth, verse 10, and experience self-destruction, verses 11 through 14. In this day and age of internet availability, that's an important lesson for us all. And then verses 15 through 19, enjoy your own spouse and therefore avoid sexual immorality, verse 20, which leads to destruction, verses 21 through 23. So chapter five is all about um, the sexual sins. Avoid sexual immorality, enjoy the spouse that you have is the big lesson. We need divine intervention and help because our culture is saturated with the selling of sex. It's everywhere. Let's pray for divine intervention. Father, we come before your throne and we thank you and praise you for providing us spouses. Father, we thank you and praise you for the, um, the gift of the Holy Spirit and his job to guard and protect us from sin. We want to resist the temptation of sexual immorality. And I pray, Father, for divine intervention. Help us to be sexually pure and sexually innocent. Help us to stay faithful to our spouses if we are married. Guard and protect our hearts, which is so easily carried away by all forms of sexual immorality. We love you, Father, and we lean into you needing your help and your protection, especially in the culture that we live in. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.